Okay, so we've got a cubic uh, graph here because it goes down and up and then down again. And we're asked to find the equation of the graph. Now, the problem with this is the normal method is to put down three brackets and any solution it gives us in the graph, we write down um, the opposite, the, inv the inverse sign, right? So uh, for this one here, it would be x minus 6 because 6 take away 6 is 0 therefore that's a solution and for this one here it would be plus 7 because 7 take away 7 uh, is a solution right because it equals 0 but the problem we have here is we've kind of uh, run out of solutions um, and therefore the natural thing is to think well maybe it's a quadratic but we can see it's not a quadratic, it is a cubic, so it needs to have three brackets. And not all cubics make three brackets, but this question will. Um, so we've got to think, well hang on, we actually have two solutions here. We've got the down solution and we've got the up solution. So that actually represents two solutions, not one. And if you have a look at here, we've just got one solution because it just goes through once. So when it turns on the axis, it gives us two solutions. So there are two lots of x plus 7. So a bit of a, a, bit of a unique situation that, but it's useful to remember.